promise y'all. Not a normal candy cane. So this is a sour patch candy cane. It's orange, but I don't know what the flavor would be. Ain't that crazy? That orange is a color, but it's also a flavor. And it's like a fruit. Huh. Man, the English, <laughs> English language is so crazy. <laughs> hmm. Roll clip. creators out there this is your boy camera back again with another video and in this video this is actually a little bit overdue i will say and i am sorry because your boy was just just doing way too much back then but at least i recorded the clips and i was recording the bts of it so i knew i wanted to do a video but i just couldn't put it all together for whatever reason we're not going to talk about old cam because we onto the new cam now but in this video um i wanted to show you guys how to do more of a, a cheap whore on budget type of boudoir shoot um so of course my girlfriend jenny who is beautiful beyond belief um we took a trip to Michael's, um, and if you don't know what Michael's is, it's a craft and art store, um, pretty, just great stuff. My girlfriend's also a little artist as well in her own, in her own little world. Um, yes, she's going to be a nurse, but I really love her art, her artwork, um, her paintings, her, her drawings, they're all amazing. But Michael's is a craft and art store where you can pretty much find anything from color pencils, paint woodwork metallic work uh poster boards uh picture frames uh, shadow boxes um just they have everything that you can really think of when it comes to arts and crafts so this idea i, I kind of just had was just to have her be in black lingerie and then i would have these golden type of like confetti string things hanging from our ceiling i was going to tape them up um, but I couldn't find that. Um, so I had to improvise with what I did find out. But for this one, I really wanted to brighten her up. I really wanted to show her all of her, like, you know, her, her curves and her skin tone. And I wanted the golden little tassel things that I got to really like, you know, pop and explode. So we also bought this little black fake rose that we use that, um, you necessarily wouldn't be able to tell that it was fake just by the pictures. It didn't really take much like, you know, we were we're on our bed. I just kind of put down a white sheet again, like just to blow all of that light, just to make it so bright around her. And I personally love these photos. It's just because of the overall vision that I had. And I feel like when you have an idea or you're trying to be really creative in this in this art space, when you go out, even if it's on a budget or even if it's something cheap, you really put a lot of energy and a lot of effort into it. And even if, like I said, I wanted to like, like go like kind of um, confetti or strings hanging from the ceiling, like kind of like over her. One day I'll be able to do that. I'll find what I want and I'll do something like that. The shoe was very fun. Um, Jenny was very tired. As you can see at the end, she's just in bed, just passed out. Um, she had just like had a long day at work. I got a promotion and everything. So she, and she's, uh, she's my muse, you know, and I, I'm always trying to get her into uh, my art, even when she's had a long day and I, I really love her for that. Just showing you guys the creativity and the overall, um, progression that I kind of just want to go ahead and, uh, show you guys that I've been doing, I've been taking. So yeah, so it was pretty fun. And again, I see you guys in the next video and just make sure you're cultivating and creating. Peace guys.